In the Patagonia, a remarkable corner of the planet where deep blue glaciers have carved out the spectacular fords, we are forging a new path in conservation. Surrounded by towering mountains that jut out of the water, it is a place where the lush temperate rainforests coexist with the Icelands and the thermal springs. Playful dolphins, gregarious whales, soaring condors, sea lions resting on ice, and playful seals bringing into focus the vitality and resilience of this majestic and important place. This spectacular wilderness affords us the opportunity to genuinely experience all the remarkable endowments of our humanity. Conservation is human. It is tradition, a closely held value of cultures present and long since disappeared, seen and unseen, aquatic and terrestrial. Conservation connects us to nature and gives depth to our emotions and thoughts. Where we see majesty, grace, and serenity, we can also see that it is being depleted. Manifestly before us is the stark contrast between what once existed just a generation or two ago, and what is and what may exist for our children and their children. Glaciers, nature's hourglasses, are visibly emaciated and famished. How much time do we have? A question inherently tied to our own personal human experience, which when asked before the sheer magnificence of a glacier, compels us to think of others and future generations. Glaciers reveal the extensive reach of human activities. Ecosystems all over the world are under duress. There is no remoteness on Earth any longer. Pristine forests and virgin lands are finite. We all know conservation is critically important. But for many of us, conservation remains a remote and aspirational value, relegated in priority not because of lack of conviction, but because of lack of opportunity. Conservation is for everyone. Where conservation has traditionally meant trying to convince others to act, lawmakers, philanthropists, CEOs, we can now act directly. Conservation is an opportunity, an opportunity to live with passion and purpose to define our legacy, and to consciously connect with nature. The Real Eco-State